Uh, we had an amazing day today and a lot of things happened. We had an open day here at the Jesus Center the Ark and you came with your friends. Have been a good day? Yes, it's been a wonderful day. And she came with this or yeah, often she actually, walked with this. I drive with this on because my neck is not allowed to be jarred. So I put this on, get me places and it's to protect my neck which had a deformity, which had surgery. I had a lot of surgery. My surgeon said, We've done all we can do for you. That's it. So I, you know, I've been out of state. I drove like a thousand miles to see a specialist in another state, back, forth, back and forth, and I wasn't done. I mean, it wasn't healed. I could not do what I wanted to do, mm. which is sad. <laughs> so what happened today? And then today, I asked for prayer for healing, and I was delivered. I. It was, this is something that you can be a Christian and have some oppression on you it's not like I felt like I had you know I didn't love Jesus enough or whatever it's just that I had something on me that I had no control over I felt like I didn't and so I was prayed for and I felt it come out of me I feel great in my neck I'm looking around I'm doing things and one of the problems when I got here was um I would be in, a, we were in a room with a lot of people, way busier than what's behind us now. And I couldn't focus, I could it was just, just confusion. And then after my deliverance and baptism, I came and I teased you, because <laughs> I said, I can pay attention to everything you're saying, you're boring, but... <laughs> That was nice. Huh? Yeah. <laughs> we, I was sitting upstairs with a lot of people, a lot of noise. And yeah. she, after she got delivered today, she got baptized. And she came in and said, I can sit here. I can be here now. Yeah, I couldn't stay up there more than five minutes. I came downstairs and stayed outside for a while because the, the noise was, my mind was polluted as far as I could tell. And so now that I've been delivered and I got baptized and I was able to sit and enjoy what Torben can say, I could probably remember it until now, <laughs> which is really good. So I want to say to you out there, next time we have like an open house here at the Jesus Center. How many hours did you drive? Three. Three hours to come here. <laughs> There's people who have been driving 15 hours to come here because they saw it on Facebook or YouTube. Yeah. Come and join us next time. <laughs> we put it out. It's worth it. And we had a really amazing day. Yeah, we did. God bless you.